Ladies and gentlemen, John Gorman O'Brien, real estate I work with my friend Zoe Zhao. We have a beautiful townhouse behind you at 6B, Forster Court here in Bentley East. Now, talking about the location quickly, one of the major things buyers look for in this area are being in school zones. And this one's in the McKinnon Secondary College zone. That is one of the most sought after uh, public schools in Victoria. And that's just down the road there too. So this is in the zone, which adds value to your property. But let's have a look through this one. We're asking 1.75 to 1.8 million on this. If you have any interest, let us know. We'll give you a tour of the place too. So when you buy a property and you buy a townhouse, you want to look for townhouses that have been built by builders to live in. So when this was originally built, the builder that built this built him for himself to live in, and then our clients bought it from him. Got nice electric gates at the front. We'll go through and inside, have a look. And I'll point a few little key aspects for you that are nice. We've got a hydronic heating through here, beautiful polished timber floors. This is a bedroom downstairs. You've got a high ceilings too. Two pack cabinetry on all the doors here as well, which is a nice little feature. We'll take you through the rest of the house as well. Beautiful cornices, walk right comes through to the left. Got a bathroom down here, floor to ceiling tiles, which is really nice. Frame with showers, hydronic heating throughout the house too. So hydronic heating is something that you want to look for that's really good for your breathing. If you have kids with asthma or anything like that, it's like the, the one of the most popular forms of heating for homes. Beautiful open plan living here. Look at the lighting, split systems in pretty much all the bedrooms too, and all the rooms. Nice courtyard here, and this has a north facing orientation in this courtyard too. So that's why it's so nice and bright down here, pretty much at any time. Storage through here. This is your laundry, even Caesar stone bench tops in the laundry there, which is really nice. So this is a great family home for the living. You got video intercom. Over here. Yes. All your bells and, uh, bells and whistles. Now this is your family living and dining. As you can see, it's absolutely massive. So this townhouse is well over 30 squares in size, which is really large. Undermount sinks through here. All the appliances are integrated here. Integrated Neff coffee machine, gas ducted, uh, gas ducted cooking, uh, stone apply, uh, stone bench tops, waterfall bench, waterfall bench tops here. Now the entertaining out here is really cool too. So if you have a look at this, imagine yourself entertaining and living. That's at, beautiful. At it. It's really cool. It's really nice. There's a water feature over there. I feel like you're in Bali or something. What do you think, so? Yeah, I think it's a, definitely like a retreat <laughs> style, like a Bali retreat. You've even got a projector on this wall too, so you can kick back here. You've got your barbecue, it's all plumbed in. You've got your water out here too. So this is where you kick back and enjoy yourself with your family, your friends, or the boys, I would say. Come through. So it's a really big townhouse. Like Some of these townhouses are small. This is a really nice big townhouse, Zoe. Yes, it is. I uh, think... Uh, yeah, the ceiling height and also the finishing. I heard about like the, this is uh, owners like the, this is the uh, um, past a few years the builders house um, building for themselves. That's so, exactly what I was saying. Yeah, so you want to you want to buy something that's been built for a builder to live in, which I like, which I mentioned before. Okay, massive landing space here. So for the kids to kick back and watch some TV, it's like another retreat for the kids here too. Let's show the master on here. So, walk into the master. How big is this? Oh, that's beautiful. Master bedrooms. Oh my God. Walk in row. Pretty cool. Yep. Nice and big. Now, I call this a dual vanity. So, his and hers in the bathroom here. Massive bathroom with your shower, too. Like I said, floor to ceiling tiles. Pretty standard now, but it's what you want to see in townhouses. Very beautiful, and look at the size of their bedroom. Look at that. So big. Oh, <laughs> so nice. I compare a couple of like the um, current build something, uh, new build. Uh, the bedroom size is a huge. Okay, so check that as well. Separate toilet. Beautiful. You got your spa bath there as well. More storage here, more storage over here too, Zoe. Check that out. It's like a linen press, I guess. But even all these doors are two-packed finished. Yep. Which is just that little bit extra they've gone to. 
one of the kids' rooms here, but it's a big size room. One, two, three. So this looks like it's three by one, two, three, four, five. So three by five meters is a very big bedroom for the kids. Heaps of storage here in the cupboards. And then there's another big bedroom down here. With your balconies, which is great. They can come and have a look at these on. Oh, and wow. if you look over there, see that big white thing? Yep. That's GSAC, which is Glenara Sports and Aquatic Centre. Yep. So they spent about 50 million building that. I could be off, but roughly in those vicinity, building that years ago. We had uh, families coming over from Caulfield, all around these areas to use that facility. And that used to be my local gym. So that's all state of the art uh, council run facility there with pools, tennis courts. Um, there's a gym there as well. It's absolutely beautiful. So GSAC literally just down the road a couple of minutes, which is fantastic. Yep. So geographically, not going past how good the townhouse is, but you're in the McKinnon zone, got GSAC down the road. Bentley East was, I grew up in Bentley East, uh, Melbourne's most livable suburb for a very long <laughs> yes. time. Yes, yes. And check out the size of that too. Oh, wow. That's a walking roll. So I'll go back downstairs, but this is it. So 1750 to 1.8. Let Zoe or myself know if you have any interest. We'll show you one last look at the downstairs living. There's a lock-up garage too. Nobody corporate. It's on its own title. It's pretty much its own house. So, let us know if you have any interest on this property. And hopefully we'll see you in an open for inspection really soon. Thank you so much. No worries. Thank you. Peace. Bye. Bye.